So today I'm talking about a Nissan with the P0139 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a Nissan P0139 code? Well, it's an O2 sensor, circuit slow response, bank one, sensor two. And what does this mean? Well, the onboard computer uses oxygen sensors located on the exhaust to know how much oxygen has been burnt off during combustion. And it's seen a problem with one of these. So you have to be troubleshooting to know why. And bank one is always the side of the engine with the number one cylinder. And sensor two will be the second sensor going down on the exhaust. And some possible causes of this, well, it could be a failed O2 sensor sensor it could be in the wiring and possibly a blown fuse and so the first thing to do when you get this code is to go locate bank one sensor two oxygen sensor and this can be a little different and there can be multiple sensors it's going to vary it's going to depend if you have dual exhaust or single exhaust the year the type of engine so it's always a good idea to get a diagram of where the oxygen sensors are on your particular Nissan, but two is very common. And what's going on with these is you're gonna have sensor one, also called the upstream, it's gonna be before the catalytic converter. And then you're gonna have sensor two called the downstream, which is gonna be after the catalytic converter. And the one you wanna locate is gonna be this sensor two. And so once you locate it, next thing to do, check out the wiring real good, be sure it's plugged in, all these types of things. And basically just be aware, any open, short, bad connection is gonna cause the same symptoms as a bad sensor. So you wanna make sure that all looks good. Also be aware this is going to be on a fuse. There'll be a fuse box inside the engine compartment and there'll be a fuse inside there on this circuit. Sometimes this could be labeled kind of vague or sometimes they could be easy to spot like this one heated oxygen sensor number 85. So if this fuse blows then that circuit would not be working. But basically just keep in mind that these are also on a fuse. So if you check that all out the wiring looks good there's no blown fuses or anything like that then very likely this sensor has just gone bad and just needs to be replaced. You can test it if you want to. There's some good YouTube videos on that if, if you want to test it first but very likely you're going to need to replace it. One thing to mention is that some of these need a special tool to get out not all the time sometimes you can't get away without the special tool but sometimes you will need it so that's something to keep in mind for example if you have a deep well socket you can cut this wire so you can get it off and then when you go to put the new one back in you can use an open end socket it's really going to depend on the type of tools you have but if you don't have a lot of tools or anything like that or if this is recessed in right here then you will need this special tool to get around that wire and get it back in. And so that's basically it. I just want to give a real quick brief overview of how you go about fixing a Nissan with the P0139 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.